Okay. Every Planet Fitness has like a 30 minute express station. Right. And it has like the light and it has the, um, you know, all the machines supposed to target every part of your body. I'm gonna try to do the whole thing. I don't know where you're supposed to start. But um, I'm gonna start where it's easiest for me to set up my camera. Let me show you that. All the Planet Fitnesses in the world have this 30 minute station and every time I go to Planet Fitness, which I mean for years, off and on, I see this station and I'm like, I'm gonna I'm gonna try that one day. So today for some reason was the day. And I ran through everything and I felt really good about it. So I even did it again i didn't do it in any particular order because i didn't notice that there were numbers on the machines i didn't even notice that i also neglected the area in the middle which is where you like do like some step climb up from the biggest loser i didn't feel like that was something i would wanted to do so i didn't do it but um maybe you could do it if you like it i don't know i never i've also never seen anyone utilizing that ever not once so if you do that please comment below because i would love to know who's doing that if you've ever done the entire 30 minute workout routine let me know if yours is different at the gym that you go to out let me know because i don't know i don't know i've been to several planet fitnesses but i've never taken the time to do this it didn't take me 30 minutes that's why i was like let me do it again i think i did it three times in like reps of between 8 and 15 and um yeah, I felt really good afterward. I didn't do the step up, step up thing. So what I did was hit the TRX. And you can see that at the end of the video. Towards the end of the cycle, I was really feeling it. I was like, okay, okay, burn. It was working many of my muscle groups. I did not feel like it worked all of them, but like enough. You know, it got the arms moving, it got the legs moving, got the abs moving. What more can you ask for? But, you know, there's just certain motions that I didn't feel, that I felt were neglected. But I can see how this is a great quick workout. Hit, hit the abs and, you know, finish up strong. I felt strong. I felt healthy. And this is how the step workout station is looks. But, yeah, like I said, I wasn't doing none of that. Not at all. Especially since I knew I was going to hit the TRX. I was like, why would I do this? TRX got my legs moving and like it just incorporated some flexibility, some stamina, strength building, core building, you know, essential elements that I'm going to need going forward. I'm going to try to post more stuff where I work out because I'm really on my fitness tip right now and I'm just going to push myself as far as I can possibly go and see where that takes me. So what, if you're welcome to follow me on that journey, make sure you subscribe and you like and you hit the notification bell and all that good stuff so that YouTube can respect me in these streets. Because right now, mm, they, mm, 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 it's another story. So yeah, once I finish up with that, I like to either hit the elliptical to get that lactic acid moving or I just hit the jump rope. And sometimes I do both. One thing about me and my rope, I'm going to do some tricks. I've been jumping rope for a long time. I got really good at it, really confident about it. And there are other things that I would like to learn and incorporate into my tricks. But this is one of my favorite forms of cardio or just working out in general. Sometimes this is the only form of working out I'll do because it hits all my muscle groups, especially the way that I jump rope. And also it just, it just boosts my mood. It makes me feel confident. It makes me feel like my heart is pumping. My blood is pumping everything is working keeps me youthful and you know enthusiastic and jumping rope is like one of my favorite exercises i often tell people and i know they're trying to cut weight get a rope if you don't have nothing else get a rope if you can get a kettlebell because sometimes you can't do squats and this that, and third and equipment can be heavy but if you got a jump rope and a kettlebell you you gotta you basically got a gym basically got a gym all you need now is the desire to actually put in the work so i wish you all the best with your journey wherever that may lead you and wherever you are on it remember that where you are is somebody's goals even if you think you're at the bottom somebody would is raising their arms up to be at that so-called bottom and even if you think you're on the top there's always a higher that you can go so humble yourself okay so yeah then i wrap it up i don't shower in no damn gym sorry not no planet fitness no sir i don't care if i had slippers i wouldn't do it
I wouldn't do it. But yeah, I get my stuff together and I just roll out. I shower my home and I feel really good. Every time I leave the gym, I feel I feel I feel like I did something. Like, you know? Like I feel proud. And why not? I'm paying for it. Might as well you utilize it. Most people they go to the gym, they get a membership and then they never actually use it. Stop paying these people and do yourself a favor and get healthy because if you don't use it, you lose it. Okay?